The U.S. Navy held Treasure Island in San Francisco Bay for 56 years, from 1941 to 1997. The island was the Navy's central command in the bay. In 1945, the U.S. dropped atom bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki, Japan. All wars became nuclear. The Navy established nuclear schools on the island and stored radioactive material there. Various accidents polluted the island with radiation. In 1987, the Navy began cleaning radioactive areas. They erected protective fences. In 2017, they declared the North Point Solid Waste Disposal Area toxin-free and removed the fences. This former radioactive dump became a large open field where people could freely walk. However, in 2019, two years later, the Navy suddenly closed off the area again. They put back the fences and dug deep holes inside, hanging a yellow radiation sign at each hole. We visited the area in 2017, 2018, and 2019 before and after they replaced the protective fences. On August 28, 2018, we walked along North Point Drive in a northwesterly direction toward the newly reopened radioactive cleanup zone. We noted addresses where people were living near radiation the Navy missed. Twelve thirty nine C. Twelve thirty seven unit is this one. Between the buildings you can see a corner of Austin Hall where they stored radiation, dioxin from a former burn area, and radiation from a storage yard, which had affected all the residents. People are walking along the perimeter path.
it and I'm going to zoom in. One big hole right here, it has two big holes, and then you see a three big hole. So it's three, oh wait, actually it's four holes. Three, and then one behind there, four, five, six. So there's actually six big holes that they dug back here, but only two of them is flooded with water. The reason why I stopped talking is because this is like so surreal to me like how this was close because they knew something was behind here but then they said oh it's nothing and they reopened it and like I really drove past here like oh they they took the gates down but look the gates back up now they got all these signs up here that says radiation. residents even though this apartment building has been abandoned this whole time it's still pollution people should be able to be in a community where it's no radiation in this is sad and that's why i've just been quiet live in here these are residents and they're right here to radiation though i wouldn't even feel safe living next yeah the man is in there he came outside All right, and look at where this fence goes. It goes all around here. Let's, do you need any? And look at the sacrifice I had to do for these beautiful shots, you guys. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Sacrifices. <laughs> for the people, though. It's for the it's people. It's for the people. <laughs> Asia, my hero. Yay. Yes. Saving one <laughs> island at a time. <laughs> Yeah, a little comic relief on this very serious video. Look at how that fence, look at how big that fence is. Oh, look at, there. that's that's long. We have to go back there and see how far that goes and if there's anything else back there. 